Nigga wanna see me fall Stephen Curry, how I ball Gosha garments and a white three on my body I'm a Nikon, man And my girl about a ten I should fuck her in the best Make it say What's good YouTube? It's your boy JR and I'm back again with another 2K video. In today's video, I'm going to be doing something that I've never really done before, but we're definitely going to give it a try. I'm going to be going over a dribble tutorial for the very best dribble moves for my sharpshooter shot crater. Now, um, all of these moves um, are pretty basic just because, you know, my guy doesn't have the high enough ball handling to be able to speed boost and do the momentum dribbles and stuff like that. But as you've seen in the clips um, before this video started, I do have a few moves that I use to get open. I feel like they're pretty effective. So I'm just going to show you guys all of my drill moves. Um, you'll see that in the video. And then I'm also just going to give you a tutorial of all the moves that I that I use, and then a, a few moves that I'm, a few moves that I'm currently working on as well. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Please hit that sub button. If you're new, it really help me out. I cover 2K, of course, PUBG, and Blackout comp, uh, content. Hit that like uh, button if this video helps you out in any way. I'd really appreciate it. But yeah, man, I'm just going to go ahead and show you my dribble moves. Let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, guys. So here are all of my dribble moves. Um, I'm going to scroll down here in a moment. You can pause it if you need to. Leave me a comment and let me know if you have a dribble move that you think is better than what I have right here. I would love to try any out. Um, of course, the only thing I don't want to hear is if you're a sharpshooter build like me or a stretch big and you say left or right where you're just... <laughs> yeah, not, none of that, bro. Um, <laughs> so yeah, man. So we use, I use moving crossover 3, moving behind the back pro 3, moving spin pro 4, moving hezzy pro 2, standing size up combo pro 3, moving size up combo pro 3, Size Up Package Pro 2, Size Up Double Hezzy, Damian Lillard, Size Up Double Crossover, Chris Paul, Size Up Between the Legs, Trey Young, Size Up Double Behind the Back, Trey Young as well, Triple Threat Styles, Normal 2, Triple Threat Style, Size Up Pro 8. So yeah, man, those are all my drill moves. If you don't equip them exactly like this, then some of the moves that I show you guys, you know, may not work properly, so just a heads up. Alright, so... <clears throat> I show you guys my mock core. I'm just going to show you some of these moves. I mean, like I said, they're pretty basic, but I'm just going to show you some of the things that I do that I feel like are really effective. Even with um, bronze ankle breaker, I I guess I, sometimes I'll snap snap off ankle breaker animations as well. So I mean, a lot of these moves are are really good. So I'm just going to start from like the very top. So I really like the size up right here. You just do that by flicking up on the right analog, especially when he goes behind the back the first time. You'll see like if you turbo out of it, he'll get like a little speed boost, which is really good for like creating space. Um, another thing that I do, like especially if there's a screen, I'll do this little animation right here. And you can use that to kind of play around the screen. You just do that. The ball is in your right hand. You flick left and you flick back right on the stick and you get this little animation right here. Um, another thing that I like to do, you'll see, especially like Playmaker builds do this, they'll do this, it's like a little glitch um, step back move, you can you can pretty much spam it, especially if you're getting pressured. This will help you create space, um, you just do that by holding turbo and you just spam back on the right stick and you get that animation. Um, that's a really good one and eventually all these moves you can just combo up together. Um, one thing that I do a lot, and you saw this in the beginning of the video, is this animation right here, which it I don't know why it creates so much space, especially if you have a screen and you go the opposite way. If they play the screen, 
you get so much space and this is probably my favorite move that I do a lot. So to do this move, if the ball is in your right hand, you hold turbo, you go between you if the ball is in your sorry. If the ball is in your right hand, you hold turbo, you push um, diagonal left on the stick, and then you'll get that animation right there. And then you push back and he'll do that little animation. Pretty simple. Um and then another one, uh, this animation right here is really good. You just push back on the stick and you'll get this right here. I feel like dribbling with the sharpshooter is more about, I guess the animations you have as far as your actual stick skills, stick skills go, because I can't even speed boost with this dude. Um, so these are just simple animations that I have equipped that I feel like get me open. So hopefully that'll work for you. But um, like I said, this little behind the back right here, you can sit there and spam that and you can just speed boost out of it and then you'll get the Trey Young behind the back animation once you go back twice which can create space as well so that's a really good one um, another thing that you can do before you go into your size up you can spam this right here and you basically just hold turbo and if the ball is in your right hand you go between you go diagonal to the left side then diagonal to the right side hold turbo the whole time and you'll sit there and you'll You'll spam this, you can use that, then you can like speed boost out of it, like get that little speed boost out of it or whatever you wanna do. Um, that helps create space. Um, one thing that I do a lot coming down the court, hopefully this will give me a lot of room. So what you'll do is when you're going to, when you're coming down the court, you will hold turbo and then spam the, the right stick diagonal left and right. So if the ball is in your left hand, you'll spam it to the right and then back to the left and over and over. If you do that, you'll get this animation right here. And that right there will snap off a lot of angle breakers. And then I do, I usually do two things out of it. One thing that I'll do is when I'm coming, uh, actually, let me go back. So once I start dribbling up the court, I'll sit here and spam it and then I'll go behind my back. That creates space or another thing that I really like to do is spin out of it. So when I'm coming down the court, I hit the spin right here and that creates a lot of space. Like you saw it in the clips in the beginning and I'll try to put it, edit it in this part of the video as well. Come down the court, just spam it and then hit that spin. And I swear it, it, um, it creates a lot of space. Um, another thing that I'll do if I'm dribbling down the court, a lot of times I hit, you know, just a normal behind the back. Pro 3 is definitely my favorite one, so I recommend, that, that's why I recommend that one. Um, another thing that I like to do, this was really effective on 2K18 just because it would give that animation and it would create so much space. Um, but you can do this little step back right here and then you can just combo out of it, whatever you want to do. So, I mean, if you don't know how to do that, you just, whenever you're running towards the basket, stop let off a turbo and then we just push back on the right stick and you'll get this little animation right here. I use that a lot. Um, it helps me get open. So yeah, man, I mean, basically all those moves you can just combo up. I really like doing like this little spin and you just do that whenever you're like, I do it out of the size up a lot. So once I do the size up right here, he'll go behind his back and if the ball goes to your right hand, you just spin the stick the opposite way of your right hand and he'll get that little um, spin animation that's a really good one that I use sometimes um, another good one is the little step back so you just put like whenever you're running diagonal from the basket you just push right on the stick and he'll get that little animation right there you can spam that if you need to and then you can also spin out of it which is really effective as well you can spam that so to do that little <clears throat> move right there so to do that move right there, you push back on the stick and then rotate the right stick the opposite side of your ball hand. And you can just sit there and spam it like that. So yeah man, that's really effective as well. Alright, so I've showed you every drill move that I do. Um, so now, I mean, I just, you know, I combo everything up. You know, I try to have my own style as far as drill moves. But I've also learned drill moves from other people and try to make, you know, try to change them up to the way that I want to play. So that's really all you gotta do, but try out these animations and then, I mean, next, the only thing, you know, really, you just need to combo everything together. So like, 
let's see if I can get enough room here. Like the move, the key, the best move that I, that I think, oh my god, the best move that I think um, you can use for your sharpshooter is when you come down the court and you spam this move right here. Do the spin out of it and do the between the legs and then combo out of the spin like. Like right here, I'll spin and then I'll do the Trey Young move right there. And then after I do both them moves, if it's not open, a lot of times like I'll hit the little glitchy behind the back and then I'll hit the rhythm dribble and then I'll speed boost out of it. I mean, there's just so much stuff you can do. Like you can, you know, hit the Trey Young between the legs. And then if you got to step back, do the spin. You know, come back, spin again, just whatever you need to do to get open. And then, of course, you're, as a sharpshooter, you're probably going to have screens. And that's going to help you out any more, even more. So, I believe that's basically all the moves um, that, I, that I can think of that I do. Hopefully, you know, some of these will are new to you. Hopefully that they will help you um, create more space and stuff like that. Um, but, yeah, man, like I said, I just want to emphasize where you come down the court and you spam this right here. Because that's key. That gets me open a lot, um, and I use that a lot too. I mean, if you ever feel like you're getting like over over pressured, it's always key to hold left trigger, and you know you basically protect the ball. But <laughs> I just, you know, it seems like most people want to do this the whole entire time until they get open, and that's not what I'm about. I mean, I'll I'll left right sometimes if like if I feel like the defender is overplaying the screen, like if I'm getting a screen on the left side. I'll do this and then I'll go back real fast just because the defenders are playing it. But generally, you see people doing this in the park, especially stretch big, just left, right, over and over again. So I wanted to make a video to come out with actual drill moves the way, you know, real basketball is supposed to be played. So I don't know, man. Let me know if this helps you out in any way. I definitely tried my best to explain everything the best that I could. So yeah, man, that's all my drill moves. Um, let me know, like I said, let me know what you guys think. Drop a like, drop, drop a sub if you're new. It really helped me out. Help me get to that 1K, uh, 1K mark. Uh, let me know if um, if you're going to try out any of these. I mean, I just definitely, I just want some feedback to see if those moves are any good. Or let me know if you guys have something better. I'm down, like I said, I'm down to try anything. But thank you guys so much for watching, um, and I appreciate all the new support that I've gotten here recently, and all the support since day one. Thank you guys so much. Till next time, peace.